Hello, this is Carl Hoff, and I'm here to show you my real 5x5x5. Five by five by five. Uh, I finally got the thing together. Um, I do have a couple issues with it so far. Um, one is I use masking tape to uh, hold the pieces together while I assembled the puzzle, and that's left all sorts of residue on the surface. Um, I thought that would come off with IPA. Uh, it didn't, and I have now tried acetone and acetone hasn't made much of a dent in it either. So I'm curious what you guys have in the way of recommendations for removing this gunk that's left on the surface from the masking tape. I've seen others use masking tape for this purpose, so I assume there's a good way to get it off, uh, but I haven't figured it out yet. Um, the functionality of the puzzle, um, right at the moment I've only got uh, seven screws in it. It's designed to have 12 screws that hold the puzzle together um, But it basically holds itself together without the outermost screw. There is the only face there that's got the uh, center screw the outer center screw uh, in place um, The five by five layers turn as expected um, Here I'll give a quick demonstration of a one of the five by five turns um, And you can see a little tricky here with the camera between me and the puzzle uh, but it does turn and the center two center circles stay fixed um, as expected um, And uh, basically there's been very little breaking into the puzzle here so far um, the uh, Deeper layers turn as well um, So you can see I can turn the puzzle like this uh, So far no pieces have popped um, the piece I was most worried about is the smallest piece uh, right here um, but it hasn't popped, uh, hasn't jammed too badly. There is some sticking, um, but uh, the puzzle uh, mostly turns. The problem here though, um, even though the 5x5 five five layer turns like I want it to, uh, see here that the two center circles stay in place, if I turn the top two layers, then I expect the inner circle to stay fixed and then this outer layer to turn with the layer below it. So if I turn it like this, this center circle should stay fixed and it's not. Um, I got a screw in there, it's not tight, um, but uh, you can see that the center circle is turning um, with the uh, core. I don't know if you can tell or not, but the, there's multiple pieces to the center axis here. The profile of the 3x3 faced axis here in the center, um, but the piece below this piece is square. These pieces are supposed to butt up against it and you can tell that the uh, oops not that face but you can tell that when I turn this layer that these pieces are getting pushed out so that piece is not rotating like it's supposed to however this top face center is rotating um, I think I know how to fix that with a design change in just two pieces so I'm probably in okay shape there however I can tighten up this screw enough that it's very hard to rotate it still does rotate um, and uh, but even if I could keep that center face from rotating, I just don't think there's enough grip on the foot of that piece right here to overcome all the friction um, present in that inner circle. Um, so at this stage, there's a couple things I'm considering. Uh, maybe a slight design change to make the feet that interact with this face center, or this face circle with the, the ring uh, smaller so that to minimize the friction. Um, another thing I've considered is sending this whole thing to Brandon and letting him tumble it um, and see if the top tumbling uh, improves uh, the friction performance. Um, but overall, I have at the moment, I believe, built a 5x5 five five circle puzzle. Uh, not quite the one I intended to make. Uh, it's basically a single circle center. You can think of these inner two circles as always being fixed relative to each other, so you essentially just got one. Um, and it is a 5x5, five five, so all five layers uh, turn. So it is a functioning 5x5x5 uh, five by five by five circle puzzle, which I don't think anyone has demonstrated yet. I've seen pictures of some single circle 5x5 five five, uh, circle puzzles, but I've not seen any videos. So this may be the first video that gets uploaded. I've got some videos of the assembly of this puzzle too that I'm going to try to edit a little bit and get them uploaded too. Um, but uh, right now, friction in the center circle needs to be overcome. Um, and I think if I had a way of gripping this um, and turning it, 
which it's really hard to grip just by those little indentions. Maybe I may make me a piece, a little custom tool on Shapeways that can grab that. If I could grip that and turn it so that I could break in those surfaces, um, then once I tighten the center screw, um, that may be enough to overcome the, the friction and, and may function the way it's supposed to. So I think I'm very, very close to having what I want. Um, and I want to get the gunk off the outside and I want to get this center circle performing the way that I intended for it to perform. Um, but that's where things stand at the moment and I wanted to give you guys a quick update. So I appreciate you watching. Thank you very much.